This is, uh, you have pulled off, I don't think people quite appreciate the coup that you've pulled off with this show, uh, Tommy, because it is about a L.A. A police chief, and yet it is filmed in New York City. Yeah. Which is uh, insane. Yeah. Because usually, like, sometimes they will shoot, like, Vancouver and try to make that look like New York because it's cheaper in Vancouver. Nothing is more expensive than New York City, and yet here they are pretending to make it look like Los Angeles. You know, it, I think it, for it to be a coup, I had to have some sort of volition, I think. Right? Yeah, that's true. Because yeah. I didn't with this. I, I read it, and I thought, oh, this is so good, but it's in L.A., oh, well. And yeah. that was the end of it. And then my agent came back and said, well, what if they shot it in New York? I thought he was, like, making a joke. <laughs> yeah. But apparently he wasn't. They, yeah. You know, we have our palm trees, and we stick them in front of each location. And, and it works. Yes. Are there ever... I mean, we've only had one episode air so far. We <laughs> yeah, haven't had a ton of that's comments. True, like, that's that's true. not L.A. <laughs> so we'll see. We'll see yeah, how it goes. Uh, what about, are there, uh, have there been moments where the, I mean, obviously, it's, there are different weather patterns. Indeed. Yeah. Well, you know, on my phone, I have us shooting uh, exterior scenes in a uh, squall. Do you remember that night where there were those crazy snowstorms, yeah. I don't know, November or something? <laughs> Yeah, I was insane. It yeah. was really insane. The poor guys would come out and like wipe all the cars down. Roll camera, roll camera. <laughs> anyway, I don't know if this thing, you know, if it has legs. We'll see. We'll, we'll see. see. We shall see. You, uh, how do you, uh, you have been, uh, you appeared in shows with police before. You've never played, I believe this is the first time you played a police officer? Well, yes, it is, I guess. I played an EMT and a, and a, a prison warden. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, of course. I mean, they're all, they all carry things to hit people with. I don't know. It's all. <laughs> Do you think you, in general, would have made a good police officer? Is that something? I do. I do, actually. Uh, it's an interesting question. I, I'm bossy. Yeah. I'm type A. I like to tell people what to do. <laughs> that all sounds pretty much right. Know, the job it. description. Uh, pretty much, yeah. What about uh, the uniform? Do you enjoy that as a? Yes. Yeah. I gotta say, and I mean, I like the authenticity piece, but the 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 uniforms are made out of like some plastic amalgamation something. Yeah. Horrible. They're so uncomfortable and. I mean, I have a whole new... <laughs> that's what it takes for me to have a, you know, a respect for the cops, that they're able to wear these things all day. They're just horrible. horrible. You, uh, I mean, a very uh, unique uh, uh, costume over, over years you did was uh, Carmelo Soprano. Did you find over time that you, uh, you enjoyed that style? Did you, like, go, I like Carmelo's style? Or were no. you very happy to say goodbye Never to Never happened. Yeah. Not once. Yeah. Even at the end of all the years of shooting, that they'll often say, so, take a look at your wardrobe. Do you want to take any of it home? I was like, no. <laughs> good. That is a clean break. This is good. I need to really separate. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here. It's always such a delight to have you on the show.